Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. In a previous video, I showed you this wind loop mechanism, which uses a tape measure as the element of energy storage. However, as I mentioned in that video, several problems arise. So, in this video, I will try a slightly different approach. I still use the tape measure, but I took off the tape itself. You need to unwind the tape, taking care that this cylinder that contains the spring will not rotate, otherwise it will lose the tension. And I added a thread. The end of the spring has the thread attached to it and I added a little bit of epoxy glue to the joint. Okay, so here it is. It works pretty well. You can see the drum with the thread inside. And uh, I used three meters of thread, the same length of the original tape. In order to put it to use, I will attach our spring motor to this pendulum with escapement mechanism that I did in a previous video. As I mentioned in that video, the energy for the pendulum comes from the weight that is hanging. In other words, we are using the energy of the gravity to move the pendulum. But now I will add the spring motor from the tape measure to this mechanism to make it work. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. We have the tape measure glued to the base of the pendulum, and you can see the thread that goes to the axis of this part that moves the escapement mechanism. In the original design, the thread came over here to this pulley and then to a weight that was hanging from the thread. Let's now put the pendulum and wind it up to see how it works.
the pendulum moved at a faster pace than in the case where we had the weight hanging. And this is because the tape measure exerts a larger force and therefore makes the pendulum to move faster. To compensate this, I added more weight at the bottom of the pendulum. However, there is still too much force. But this is good because we can use this uh, mechanism of the tape measure for other purposes. Okay, that's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If that is the case, please visit my Patreon page. Thanks and see you in the next one.